Hi, this is Brad Linder with Lilliputing, and this is uh, a couple of new devices that Rockchip is showing off, showing that they have processors and capabilities to enter the wearable space. So these are not actual real shipping devices just yet, but they're showing that Rockchip isn't just for phones and tablets, but also can work in smartwatches and a Google Glass type wearable device. Uh, this particular one, you need a very large head for it to work, but uh, it is a working demo unit. It's a little hard to see here, but if you look at just the right angle, there's actually a display shining in there. And, uh, a little strip along the side that you can tap to uh, um, issue commands. So it's a wearable device with an RK3168 processor, it's a dual core chip, uh, one gig of RAM, four gigs of flash memory, and Android 4.2 based operating system, and it's the equivalent of a 1280 by 720p pixel display. Uh, also has a camera that you can use to take pictures. Uh, the smart watch that they're showing also is uh, Android based and uh, touch screen, supports different watch faces and gestures. So you said you use a DLT? And you can tap and go to a stopwatch function, for instance. I'm still getting the hang of how this works. Switch between different things. And you can definitely sort of see that it's Android here. Now, the display is not stellar. The resolution is not great. But it does show the capabilities of a, of a smartwatch running uh, Rockchip's low-power ARM-based processors. Um, again, pretty much just a demo. And if you look, this is just basically a piece of rubbery plastic or something, um, so it's not the most attractive. But it does offer basic functionality, and we can even change the background to match the uh, wristband. So there you have a quick look at some of the wearable devices that Rockchip is showing off at CES 2012. This is Brad Linder with Elizabeth.